Hello everyone and welcome to myrenovation.net. Today we're going to be talking about electric vehicle. We're going to be talking about the difference between electric and conventional vehicle. We're going to be talking about the batteries and what is the best battery that you can install for your electric vehicle. We will be talking about the charger, level 1, level 2, level 3 and level 4. What type of level do you need for your vehicle? Do you need a building permit to install this charger? We're also going to touch a base on Tesla's announcement last month that they changed the batteries for the standard range vehicle and we'll be talking about the best type of electric vehicle for 2021. So let's start the video. Let's start by explaining the difference between electric and conventional vehicle. Conventional vehicle use a gasoline or a diesel engine. This type of car, this is the one that has a tank. You go to the gas station, you fill the tank with gas or diesel. Electric vehicles run at least partially on electricity by using electric motor powered by electricity from battery or a fuel cell. So this type of vehicle, it run at it has actually both. It has a tank and it has battery, so it run both ways. The reason why I said partially here because hybrid vehicle, which I will talk about it later on on this video, offer both gasoline or diesel engine and an electric motor. Are all electric vehicle work the same way? Not all electric vehicle work the same way. There are three main type of electric vehicle. Plug-in hybrid vehicle offer both gasoline or diesel engine and an electric motor. That's what we talked about it in the last or in the previous slide. This motor is powered by batteries that can be recharged by plugging in. And we're also going to be talking about the plug-in and the kind of charger you need to have for your house. Number two, battery electric vehicle go without liquid fuel entirely. So this type doesn't have tanks, so it's entirely without fuel. Operating fully in electricity. Number three, hydrogen fuel cell vehicle converting hydrogen gas into electricity for powering the electric motor for this type. So what is the best battery for an electric car? According to Bumper B batteries, lithium ion batteries are often the best batteries because they hold a lot of energy. They are more lightweight than other options. And the most important one here is power to weight ratio is significant, which means the vehicle can travel farther on one charge. And that is the reason why most of the manufacturer or the, the electric vehicle manufacturer these days, they, they moving from different type of batteries into the lithium ion battery. So what are the main type of batteries? Lead acid batteries, are capable of up to 130 kilometers or eight miles per charge. Nickel metal hybrid battery, or we call it an NIMH batteries, are capable of up to 200 kilometers or 120 miles per charge. Number three, which is the most common one this day is, lithium ion batteries are capable of between 300 and 2400 to 400 kilometers or 200 to 300 miles per charge. And as I said, this is a type of battery that most of the car manufacturers are switching to it these days. So what is Tesla's announcement? As of October 20, 2021, Tesla announced that will change the battery cell chemistry that it uses in its standard range of vehicle to lithium ion. And that's what I said, everybody now, they are changing and moving to lithium ion. The move is likely a way for Tesla to increase profit margin on its car, while not necessarily having to raise the price because they wanna be competitive in, in the market. The firm also said that 90% of this battery produce in China. Thank you so much for watching my video. Again, please make sure to subscribe and like and talk to you on my next video. And goodbye.
to subscribe to my channel. Once you click into any video, you'll get this screen. If you find that the word subscribe in red, it means you are not subscribed. Once you click into it, it will change the gray. So red, you are not subscribed. Gray, you are subscribed. Thank you so much for watching.